How's it going everybody? Nathaniel from Arsky Insight here. Been a long time since I've done a video with my face in front of my good camera here. But I'm back. It's that time of year, my annual Christmas haul video. I am dead, like totally exhausted. Uh, probably pretty dark now that I think about it too because the background, but eh, whatever. We're gonna take a look at this year's Christmas haul. Talk talk it through, lots of content coming up. Really excited for So let's, let's break it down, talk about it, talk about Christmas. So here is my Lego collection, and I know it looks like a lot, uh, and it is a lot of Lego, but the only thing that's actually new is the modular police station. We just wrapped all this other stuff for fun to put it under the tree. Uh, all of it is stuff that had been purchased this year that I'm planning on building and reviewing some point. And I actually just built this morning the little Black Panther set, which was awesome. Might have a review coming for that. It's been out for a while, but I think it looks really great, and so... Um, I just built it. It's a fun little set. But yeah, so everything here, like Creator Set, Black Panther, uh, Night Bus, the Hogwarts Express, Kylo Ren's Shuttle, Guardian Ship, Batmobile, uh, Land Rover, Technique Land Rover, those are all sets I had before. I also have Hogwarts in the basement as well. Uh, so the only thing that's new here is the Modular Police Station, which I'm sure most of my viewers are familiar with, but if you're not, this is it. It's last year. Well, I guess technically it's still this year's modular because we're still in 2020. Uh, it came out January 1st, 2020, um, and it will be last year's modular once January 1st comes around and we get the new flat iron modular, which I love. Uh, very excited to get this. Only Lego set I got for Christmas. There's a chance that I might be getting one a little later. There's still some family and friends gifts to do, but this is the bulk of it. Only one new Lego set. But there's lots of other stuff here that I'm that I'm really excited about. And I'm going to talk about this in another video, probably my year-end video. I want to talk about really just finding myself in this channel and making content about what I want. Because sometimes I worry a bit too much about uploading the same type of video too many times in a row, that sort of thing. I'm just going to make videos about what I want. And, and I'll talk about that more later. But... Lots of this I'm going to do videos about. This is not just stuff that I got for Christmas. This is stuff that I gave my parents for Christmas. My parents got, like, this is just kind of the general overview of Christmas stuff that I plan on making content on. So, Nathaniel from the future jumping in here real quick. Uh, it was not just the police station, apparently. Just went over to my girlfriend's and we opened some gifts there. And she got me the blacksmith, medieval blacksmith, for Christmas, which is awesome. It's gorgeous. And then she herself got the Fender Stratocaster and the little Brickhead's Cockatiels. So there's actually four new Lego sets, not just the one. Um, yeah, that's just me from the future. It's getting dark now. You can see time has changed. But um, there's a few other things here. Uh, first, and probably most importantly for this channel, I got the three Perplexus keychain uh, puzzles, and they're awesome. I already got through two of the three of them. Expect videos, reviews, uh, and walkthroughs coming for them soon. I'm really excited to get that, rounding up my Perplexus collection. I just have three Perplexuses now that I'm missing. The world's smallest Perplexus original, the world's smallest Perplexus twist, and the Perplexus twisted. Uh, and I have the rest. Then I also got these awesome intrism puzzles. They are very similar to Perplexus kind of in idea, but they you build them yourself. They're wooden, they come uh, disassembled, you assemble the course, and then you play the game, uh, which just looks absolutely awesome. It's in that Perplexus vein. So excited to cover that on my channel. Like, they're going to be awesome, and I hope that a lot of you guys check them out and and, and take a look at them, because I, I cannot wait to make content on them. It fits perfectly, and I just think they're so cool. Uh, also have these uh, Minuendo earbuds. They're, they're lossless earplugs, and... Um, they're made by the same people who made the metronome watch I have. I, I, the, the company name is escaping me off the top of my head, but, uh, but they make some really good stuff, and so I'm just planning on unboxing them and maybe doing a review at some point. Uh, there's also this 15 puzzle, and again, like I'm, I want to do puzzle and game stuff, and I just want to do it because I like it. Uh, this 15 puzzle from Think Fun, it's, it packs in super nicely. I plan on doing a review and maybe some walkthrough videos for that as well, so I kind of delve into the puzzle and game world. Uh, also have this really cool one clock. 
it's a, a wooden style clock that is like no electronic components, like like no Bluetooth, no Wi-Fi, none of that stuff. It's like just a classic clock. I'm, I'm really excited about it. I think it looks awesome. Again, unboxing review coming. It's a really nice clock. It's a Kickstarter and I, I love showing off Kickstarters. Uh, over here, I got some bicycle playing cards. You, some of you might know that I've been getting into magic a little bit lately. And so I've got uh, decks, standard decks in both uh, blue and red. And then I also have blank decks. So I'll just show this, pull this out for you so you can see what I mean. Uh, standard playing deck with blank cards for magic, which is awesome, as well as a regular standard deck with full cards. Uh, so again, lots of opportunities there. I'm really looking forward to playing around with that. And that segues nicely into this other set here, which is this Melissa and Doug Deluxe Magic set. I'm really excited to break it down. Probably will do an unboxing and a review for that as well. And then finally, got uh, Dominion as well as the Exploding Kittens expansion hiding here in the back. Not going to be making any channel content on this, but games are just fun, uh, and so I'm, I'm happy that those are here as well. There is also this gorgeous uh, dugout mug with the Blue Jays logo. If you haven't heard of dugout mugs, they're awesome. Uh, they make mugs out of old baseball bats, and it's what I got my dad for Christmas. I think it looks great. I just want to show it off because... Again, really, really cool. Meant for drinking out of, such an awesome idea. Looks amazing. And so yeah, that is the Christmas haul guys. Short but sweet video. Lots of content coming soon that I'm excited about. Not as big a haul as usual, especially because there's not a whole lot of new Lego, but the, the Perplexus, the Intrism, I'm so excited about. I really am excited about some of the magic stuff here too. Uh, lots of content coming your ways. Uh, I got an update video coming out sometime soon as well, talking about this year, the new year, year end recap. I still have to do my 2000 sub thank you. I'm kind of going to all bunch it into one, I think. And there's just a bunch of videos that I've been sitting on too. So expect consistent content in the new year. That's the goal, guys. Probably another upload or two today as well as I break down all this new stuff I got for Christmas. But yeah, that's this video. Uh, if you liked it, click the like button down below. It's a great way to show your support. Subscribe for more content like this if you're interested in seeing reviews, unboxings for all the stuff that I'm showing off here. Let me know, subscribe, and you'll be notified as soon as those videos come out. And with all that said, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next video.